We do live in really uncertain days where we have more questions than answers. And for a lot of people, when we evaluate where we're at, what should our, our modus operandi be in a completely changed circumstances since the introduction of restrictions and quarantine as a result of the coronavirus. And um, I was talking with a friend the other day who said, John, turn to Psalm 91. Human history has always been in times of uncertainty, of trouble, of difficulty. In fact, Jesus says, in this world, you will have trouble. So I opened my Bible, my old trusty English Standard Version, and I looked at Psalm 91, and certain verses really struck out. The Lord says, You will not fear the terror of the night, nor the arrow that flies by day, nor the pestilence that stalks in darkness, nor the destruction that wastes at noonday. Well, we don't have arrows nowadays, but we certainly have nuclear missiles. And pestilence has always been right throughout the human history. And, and this scripture says, you don't need to fear them. And I'm thinking, wow, well, most people are afraid of being in hospital, on ventilators, on, on losing their loved ones. And scripture here says, don't be afraid. In fact, many times when the disciples were afraid, Jesus says, don't be afraid, fear not. So why can, we be, why can we be oriented without fear in the most devastating of circumstances? If we read the previous verse, because his faithfulness is a shield and a buckler. God is faithful. A shield is something big to protect you and a buckler is something small into hand-to-hand -hand combat. And what is really interesting in this is God is faithful in the big things and the little things concerning your life. In fact, he tells us that he knows every hair on our heads. He knows every little bird that falls, and he is sovereign. So this scripture from Psalm 91 says you can have faith because he is faithful, and you don't need to be afraid. In the name of Jesus Christ, on behalf of Message Week Ministries, I'm John Classic.